Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the Windows taskbar is not auto-hiding correctly. So this can definitely be really nice if you're trying to add extra space to your desktop. So if the taskbar down here is not disappearing, this tutorial will be for you. So basically, if your taskbar is auto-hidden, it will stay hidden until an application needs to open up. So this is going to be pretty straightforward and we're going to jump into it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu and you want to type in taskbar. Best match to come back with taskbar settings above system settings. You want to left click on that. So the biggest thing that is probably occurring that why it's not disappearing is that the setting is turned off to automatically hide the taskbar in desktop mode or it's turned off in tablet mode. It doesn't really matter. I would suggest turning them off in both unless you have one of those flipped screens that can do both you probably want to just turn both of them off you can see my taskbar has disappeared now unless when you scroll down you need to access it so that's pretty sh cool pretty straightforward there and then also in addition to that if you're running Windows 7 or Windows 8 you will need to go underneath taskbar and start menu properties instead so go into the start menu type that in and then on the taskbar tab you want to check mark the auto hide the taskbar make sure that's selected so if you're looking to open up hidden icons and open them up, this tutorial will also address that. So you might have a system tray icon that holds the taskbar open because it doesn't visually jump out of you that you need to address it. So this tutorial will address that here as well. So we're going to go down here. We're going to go and open up the hidden taskbar settings. I'm going to right click on something here whatever app doesn't really matter and you want to go underneath view notification options and then you just want to turn them off so just get information notification just turn them off right through there again that was just one example through Windows Defender you can do other ones as well some of them if you right click on the actual application down here might actually say preferences or something along those lines you'd want to just go under preferences and then do the exact same thing I pretty much just showed you again that might be a more of an app by app basis but you just basically want to just turn them off from showing and hiding up your taskbar view so I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out and as always thank you for watching and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye